Hey, hey, my name is Laura. I'm from the University of Hohenheim in Germany and I study the NV Euro program Environmental Management in Europe currently at SLU. What makes studying in Sweden and particularly at SLU so special for me are the flat hierarchies. So I feel like the students' opinion is as much valued and appreciated as the professors, which I haven't experienced so much in Germany. And I also really like the proximity of the university campus to nature. The river is close by and the forest and the lake. And uh, I feel very comfortable in this environment. Uppsala is the fourth biggest city in Sweden, but still it has a very cozy feeling like a village. You can go everywhere by bike and the river, which is in the center of town and also close to the campus, connects basically everything and gives it a really, really nice feeling. My home university is SLU Uppsala, but this year I'm enjoying my exchange year here at Buku in Vienna. Uh, my name is Anna Arnfeldt and I'm, I'm an exchange student from Sweden. And uh, I study now at this university Buku and I study landscape architecture. It is a great location here. Uh, you have a big park uh, next to, to campus. And uh, there's a lot of uh, different courses here, and they all are pretty small, so you get the chance to read a lot of courses with different topics. Uh, the ELS Network is a big opportunity to meet new people from around the world who are ambitious, as I am, about life science topics. So what I love about Boku is the close contact of students and professors, the focus on interdisciplinarity and sustainability. Yeah, my name is Helena. I come from University of Copenhagen and now I'm studying as an Erasmus student in Wageningen University. Uh, what is special about studying in Wageningen is the international community of the city and also that it's kind of a small city but everything in Wageningen is designed for students. I really like uh, how all the uh, classes are built up. It's both an interactive classroom and lectures and a lot of lab work. And you're on the same level as the professors, so there's no uh, problems with ever asking questions or contacting them directly. Since we're so many students, there's a lot of uh, opportunities for doing different kind of sports and stuff, and also doing different kind of classes. Like I'm doing a Dutch for Beginners class. I chose to study food science and technology because it's, for me it's a very exciting uh, field. There's always new things going on and there's always new things to discover, so it's never boring. My name is Jan. I study agricultural and environmental economics at Wageningen University. And currently I am doing an exchange semester at the University of Copenhagen at the Faculty of Science. I heard about science at the University of Copenhagen through some of my fellow students in the Netherlands. They were really enthusiastic about the university and about the city. But also one of my professors actually advised me to come and study in Copenhagen because education here appears to be very good. I like this faculty a lot because uh, the atmosphere is very informal. So lecturers and professors are actually really willing to help you and they take a lot of time to help you. Also the atmosphere is really international. They are used to having international students in their classes and the Danes really switch easily from Dan Danish to English, which is very nice and feels like homecoming being an international student. My name is Natalie. I'm an international master's student from the States. 
I'm studying with the EuroLeague for Life Sciences program, specifically the Euro Organic International Master's program. This is a program based on organic agricultural systems and agroecology. So as it is required to transfer and do a specialization at another school out of the five participating institutions, I compared my interests in the social, social connection between agriculture and communities and Warsaw offers the specialization in organic food quality and marketing where I can take courses such as sociology of nutrition, a preventative nutrition, uh, ecological aspects of food and nutrition, and much more. I'm happy to be in Warsaw and studying at SG Gebu because I have multiple opportunities to further my understanding of the relationship between organic agricultural systems and society. I would love to find sustainable solutions to the rather complex industrialized food system. And I hope to see you in Warsaw. Hi, my name is Aaron Kaczmarek. I am from Polish University of Life Sciences in Warsaw. I chose studying here because the program Economy and Management is closest to my uh, subject interested here. Uh, the best thing uh, which I can say about it, there, there is a big variety of subjects. So everything I can choose is close to my mind and easily I can choose the best option for me. I must say that this university is one of the biggest and one of the most, the most the beautiful place because there's a big campus which is best option for students to introduce each other, to make new relationships and spending time here is one of the best experiences in my life. I must say Prague is a box of surprises. Wherever I go, big street, small street, I can find everything. Museums, a concert hall, a sports game, uh, of course a lot of pubs but it's not, not the biggest value. Of course the biggest value is to know other culture, Czech culture. I made a lot of friends because we have a project together in five uh, people and also I attend a lot of courses with my new friends. I'm trying to practice my German with my German neighborhood and also my German friends. We are doing a lot of practical training outside. We regularly went to the fields to recognize and determine the fields and also the plants. And we also went to Orchard for this university and it was really interesting to look at the, all the species from apples or etc. fruits. My name is Sophia Champon. I come from Ghana and I'm a student at the Czech University of Life Sciences where I study a Master's of Science program in um, tropical agriculture. I'm specializing in um, sustainable rural development in the tropics and subtropics. Currently, I'm an exchange student at the University of Hoenheim under the ELLS program. I aspire to take future career in rural development and in Africa where improvement in agricultural production and marketing is seen as a tool for poverty alleviation. I would choose German's best agricultural university to develop my skills and knowledge. So why wouldn't I come to Hoenheim?